Hey, where where are we going today? Disneyland. Okay. And then <laughs> what are we doing tonight? I mean, we're getting pizza tonight. That's right. That's our fun. favorite place, right? Huh? At our favorite Italian place, right? Yeah. All right, guys. So uh, we are boarding a Velo Airlines, which is out of Ogden. Uh, for Utah and then we're gonna fly into Burbank and the flights are actually very affordable and um, so hopefully we'll have lots of future uploads for you and hope you guys are having a magic day Hey guys, so we're on our plane waiting to fly to Burbank and it's it's been a long time for us uh, since December of 2019 when we last went to uh, Disneyland. So uh, anyway, we want to bring you guys along and uh, take you we're going to go to our uh, restaurant tonight, um, which is Angelo, Angelo and Vinci's, which is in Fullerton, California. And we came across this restaurant, uh, when was it? 2011, 2012, around then. Yeah, and we've been going there ever since. And they're really, really good, authentic Italian food. So we're excited about that. It's my favorite pizza place. And we're excited to be able to go surprise uh, Brandon to is supposed to have a 16 hour layover in Los Angeles and we're gonna go rescue him from that <laughs> and then we're gonna take him to Disneyland <laughs> so anyway I uh, hope you enjoy the ride and you guys have a magic day thanks for tuning in all right guys, just a few things about this restaurant. It was owned by Steven Peck, who was a dancer, a choreographer, and an actor. He built this restaurant to feed his dancers in 1971. They didn't actually move to this building until 1992. Uh, the an name Angelo and Vinci derives from the name Michelangelo and Leonardo da Vinci. Uh, it is 4.6 miles away from Disneyland, right on Hot Harbor Boulevard. Oh. Okay guys, we're inside uh, Angelo and Vinci's after our short wait and um, usually they can le they let you go downstairs but it's closed because of coronavirus. So if you guys ever want to go somewhere for a fun place, please come here. <laughs> so Faye, tell me what's your favorite uh, stuff here? The pizza, and I would definitely recommend their fettuccine alfredo. I can't eat it, it makes me sick, but it's really, really good. It's super good. But Just obviously the pizza, the garlic... Fettuccine in general makes you sick, right? Yeah. But it's, yeah, it is it is worth it. It is so good, guys. Um, I have it all the time, and I do not get sick, but. <laughs> I get so sick. Anyway, we're going to get, this is kind of their menu. I don't know if you can see that. But we're going to get their uh, pizza tonight and their garlic rolls, which are really good. But their pasta meals are really, really good. Oh, no, I messed it up. Lights up from Washington Heights. Break it down. Wake up when I got this little punk I got a chance with. Great. So I wiped down the awning. Ayo, good morning. Thanks, Faith. So one nice thing was today when we uh, we arrived in Burbank and we went and got our rental car. It seemed like we had to walk forever and also to get our, our baggage, the luggage took forever. Here, oh, here comes our bread. How are we doing today? Good. We're doing good. So yeah, we arrived at the airport. We, uh, the baggage claim was, was extremely. That was just chaos. 
sorry. The, the luggage the luggage claim was extremely busy. It, I got my luggage right off the bat. And then I think Faith, we had to wait another 15 minutes for her bag to come through. And then you have to walk quite a distance to get to the car rental, but that was all good. And then thank heavens for GPS. We were down here in about an hour and 13 minutes from Burbank, taking the, uh, the back roads. But uh, anyway, I'll show you the pizza when it comes out. And um, we came here last, well, 2019, we were here for Christmas and they, it's kind of neat because they still have the Christmas tree up. So they just brought us our garlic knots that are really, really good. Faith, why don't you uh, open them up and let's right. try some. Wow, look at that. And then here comes the pizza. Wow. Thank you so much. Thank you. We are good. Thank you. So this is their pizza and it is out of this world, guys. Um, we've had it a few times. So. And again, anything on their menu is just absolutely fantastic. pretty hot <laughs> but the cheese is really good on it I can tell you that and the garlic knots are absolutely amazing <laughs> I this is my second one just because I'm waiting for this to cool off but yeah so as Faith mentioned the the pizza is just outstanding the uh, the sauce on the pizza is really really good and their crust that they, they have here is amazing. Um, I would definitely recommend trying the pizza. Um, if you haven't had the lasagna, it's really, really good. And the fettuccine, as mentioned, is out of this world. Um, just about anything on their menu, they have a great um, a dessert menu. We're not gonna have dessert tonight because We've got some other places that we're going to go that we want to add to this video. Um, but the desserts are really good. And they even have uh, large areas for banquets here at uh, Angelino and Vinci's. Um, again, um, guys, thanks for uh, tuning in with us. And um, continue, I hope you continue to watch us because we're going to have uh, future uploads that uh Here's another scene that I like. Check out this couple that are up in the balcony.
this is their basement that they have. Kind of like a haunted like um, basement, but it's right now it's closed. Okay, so we just finished up with dinner. It was excellent. Um, they also have a great takeout. It's separate from the restaurant that you can come here. And uh, their spaghetti and meatball is excellent. I recommend that. Um, again, their garlic knots, anything on the menu, I don't think you can go wrong. But uh, great place. And we'll be back soon.